Hey guys, I'm so excited to show you this amazing real estate opportunity in the French Riviera, just minutes away from the glitz and glam of Monaco. It's just minutes away from Monaco and right on the beach, so you can have your toes into the Mediterranean in no time. The view is breathtaking. Overlooking the Mediterranean Sea, you won't want to leave your balcony. And here's the kicker, it's priced at just €290,000 for a totally renovated and furnished living surface 40 square meter apartment. This one bedroom property has got some serious rentability potential. You could easily turn this into a vacation rental or Airbnb, given the prime location and stunning views. It's the perfect investment formula for anyone looking to get into the real estate game in the French Riviera. Let me tell you about the ultimate vacation rental formula in the French Riviera. It's simple, sea view, prime location, and affordable price. And this apartment ticks all those boxes. You might be thinking, but isn't the rental season short-lived in this area? Yes, it's true that it's seasonal, but there's a little secret, Monaco. With year-round events and attractions, you'll have a steady stream of renters eager to experience the magic of the French Riviera. Let's get down to the numbers of minimal rentability you can get from such investment in the French Riviera. If you rent out your apartment for 220 days out of 365 days, with an average rate of €150 Euros per night in the summer, late spring, and early autumn, and €100 Euros per night during low season, you'll make a minimum of €28,000 per year before tax. That's a strong 9% return on investment before taxes, which are quite high in Europe. And now, let me show you some real examples of vacation rentals with similar characteristics that have made a much bigger profit. You have just seen that you may make much bigger rental profit. Renting apartment from €200 up to €300 Euro per night. And it all depends on the style of your management. Let me tell you a little secret. A hidden gem that not many people know about. Just a short distance from the stunning apartment I've just shown you, lies one of the most enchanting gardens in the world. The Gardens of Hanbury. Once upon a time, in the early 18th century, a wealthy Englishman named Sir Thomas Hanbury fell in love with the Mediterranean region and decided to make it his home. He had a vision of creating a beautiful botanical garden that would showcase the diverse flora of the region, and he set about bringing that vision to life. But creating such a garden was no easy task. The land he purchased was rugged and inhospitable, and the climate was harsh. He faced many challenges, including harsh winds, rocky soil, and a scarcity of water, Despite all these difficulties, he was determined to create a masterpiece, and he devoted himself to the task with all his heart. He imported exotic plants from all over the world, carefully choosing each one to fit into the overall design of the garden. He experimented with different irrigation techniques, and carefully tended each plant, watching it grow and thrive under his care. As the years went by, the garden flourished, and it became a magnet for visitors from all over the world. People marveled at the beauty of the plants, and the stunning views of the Mediterranean Sea. The garden became a symbol of the region's natural beauty, and it helped to put the French-Italian border on the map. During World War II, the Hanbury Gardens faced a very difficult time. The gardens were located in a strategic area, between Italy and France, and this made them vulnerable to attacks and invasions. The owner of the gardens, Sir Thomas Hanbury, had to leave the property and return to England. As soon as the war broke out, he left behind the beautiful gardens that he had spent years creating and cultivating. And there was a very real danger that the gardens would be destroyed or neglected during the war. The situation was made even more complicated by the fact that the gardens were located in an area that was fiercely contested by both sides. The Axis powers had occupied the nearby cities of Mentun and Ventimiglia, and the Allied forces were advancing from the west. Despite the danger, a small group of dedicated gardeners and volunteers decided to stay and protect the Hanbury Gardens. They risked their lives every day to tend to the plants, protect the buildings, and prevent damage from bombs and shelling. 
During this time, the gardens were used as a refuge for both locals and refugees who were fleeing the war. The gardeners provided food and shelter to those in need. And the gardens became a symbol of hope and resilience in a time of darkness and despair. When Sir Thomas passed away, in 1907, the gardens were passed down to his son, Cecil Hanbury. Cecil was just as passionate about the gardens as his father and worked tirelessly to maintain and expand the property. Tragically, when Cecil returned to the gardens after the war, he found that much of the property had been destroyed. The gardens had been used as a military outpost by the German army and were left in ruins. Despite the devastation, Cecil was determined to rebuild the gardens and restore them to their former glory. However, as time went on, it became clear that he was not able to keep up with the demands of maintaining such a large property. Eventually, the Hanbury family made the difficult decision to transfer ownership of the gardens to the Italian government. The gardens are now managed by the University of Genoa, which has worked tirelessly to restore and maintain the property. While the Hanbury family is no longer involved in the day-to-day -day operations of the gardens, their legacy lives on in the beauty of this magical place. As we come to the end of this video, I hope you have enjoyed discovering the hidden gem of the French-Italian border and the perfect investment opportunity that awaits you in the French Riviera. Investing in real estate in a location like this not only offers a solid return on investment, but it also provides access to some of the most beautiful attractions in the world, including the stunning Monaco, breathtaking Mediterranean Sea, and historic places like the Gardens of Hanbury. Whether you're looking for a place to call home or a smart investment opportunity, this property has it all. And if you're interested in seeing it for yourself, don't hesitate to contact me. But even if you don't invest in this specific property, I invite you to come and visit the magical place that is the Hanbury Gardens. The history and natural beauty of this place are truly something to behold, and I guarantee you won't be disappointed. So don't forget to subscribe and like this video to stay up to date with more exciting content about the French Riviera and beyond. Thank you for watching.